They are known to be the power couple in the South African public health sector. Karaisha and Salim Abdul Karim have saved thousands of lives through decades of fighting the spread of infectious diseases. Getting the Alaska Award for Public Service is a top recognition for medical research. So I think it's both humbling and inspiring. Um, humbling because you don't think about us from Africa getting this sort of pinnacle, what's described as the uh, Nobel Prize for Science in the US. But inspiring, on the other hand, in how science, which was my initial dream, <laughs> science can change the world, and the transformative power of science being recognized and being recognized from Africa. The couple's focus on HIV followed their move to the United States in 1987. The virus was then ravaging New York. To us, when we came back to South Africa at the end of 1988, it seemed like this was going to be the next big challenge. But they were met by a government in denial about the scale of HIV AIDS. Its poor response is estimated to have cost 2.5 million lives between 1999 and 2010. South Africa became the epicenter of the pandemic. The couple has been recognized on their work on an antiretroviral treatment that reduced the spread of the virus by 39 percent. They also launched research labs and trained hundreds of scientists across Africa. New infections in South Africa have dropped to 150,000 in 2023 from a peak of around 520,000 20 years ago.